आर यू टायर्ड ऑफ मैनुअल टेस्टिंग ईटिंग अप योर डे टू डे वैल्यूएबल टाइम और यू आर इन ऑटोमेशन टेस्टिंग एंड नाउ थिंकिंग वॉट टू लर्न नेक्स्ट इन दिस फास्ट पेज टेक वर्ल्ड सो इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट वॉट इज लेटेस्ट इन ऑटोमेशन टेस्टिंग एंड हाउ इट विल हेल्प अस टू स्टे अहेड इन ऑटोमेशन टेस्टिंग वर्ल्ड एंड हाउ वी कैन यू नो इम्प्लीमेंट इन आर डे टू डे ऑटोमेशन टेस्टिंग टास्क विच विल इवेंशली हेल्प इन आर करियर I will also be telling what are different tools in all the you know uh, sections so make sure you watch till the end because the last one is very important and if you haven't subscribed my channel uh, till now please make sure to subscribe and if you like content at the end please make sure to hit the like button hi my name is amit tripathi and i have more than 9 years of working experience in it industry and automation testing Okay so let's go ahead with latest trends of automation testing so number 5 is continuous test automation so what is continuous test automation it is you know it is the trend that integrates test automation with continuous integration and continuous delivery pipelines so you must have heard about ci cd pipelines right so what are those those ci cd pipelines are basically you know help uh, uh, you know uh, to softwares to deliver fast so how basically so if you know uh, develop, developers are working on the software and then uh, they are uh, merging their code in the master branch uh, you know they are uh, whatever number of developers are there they all are working and merging the uh, merging on the master branch then what happens we have to you know uh, check also whether that merging of the code is not breaking the existing functionalities so for that we need to you know automation also need to be triggered and we need to triggered our test cases and eventually you know we need to test also so that testing process also is an integral part of ci cd pipeline so as soon as you know we trigger uh, we merge the code uh, the testing should begin so that's where you know continuous testing is in picture so it is a practice that aims to provide fast and frequent feedback on the quality and functionality of the software throughout the development life cycle continuous testing tools automate the execution and reporting of test cases at every stage of pipeline so basically continuous testing what happens it helps to get faster results of the execution so in uh, you know ci cd pipeline itself we you know we integrate so many physical systems or other systems which help us to execute our test cases much more faster so that's where you know continuous testing in today's world is very very much important and we must have heard about these continuous testing tools like a uh, jenkins you know gitlab azure devops circle ci uh, so let me know in comment box if you or your company works on any of these uh, continuous testing tools and let's go on the number 4 so number 4 is behavior driven uh, development or automation so nowadays we are uh, you know writing test cases in bdd so you know bdd is a buzzword these days because you know bdd is helping or focusing on defining and verifying the expected behavior of the software from the perspective of user and stakeholders and it helps to you know combine test automation with agile software development methodologies so in bdd we must have heard about gherkin language so what is gherkin language it's a basic simple uh, you know language which is used to write uh, bdd scenarios and eventually you know uh, it helps to be uh, you know on the same page for developers testers business users or the persons who don't have that much of technical uh, you know knowledge so it helps basically to collaborate communicate and align developers testers and business users so that's where you know bdd is in demand and if you uh, you know working in 2024 with automation or you are trying to learn automation then uh, you know consider going with bdd also 
now these all are the uh, behavior driven development tools uh, which are like cucumber so cucumber if you are working with java then cucumber is the bdd tool uh, specflow jbehave specflow is for uh, .net behave is for python jbehave is also for java so uh, that's what is bdd number 3 cloud based test automation so what is cloud based test automation see if we have to automate or if we have to execute our test cases in automation we have to uh, you know we we cannot automate or we cannot execute our test cases on the system we are working on right for that we need a separate system on which we wanted to run our test cases so that we are free our system is free and that's where you know if you have let's suppose 1000 test cases it may take so much time to execute those 1000 test cases so what is the uh, what is the solution for that you are going to have multiple number of systems okay maybe you know parallel testing is also you are going to take care of but you have to maintain physical systems but that is so costly you know maintaining the infrastructure maintaining that much of uh, uh, physical systems so that's where cloud based test automation is uh, you know coming in the picture where it helps to reduce the cost of physical systems and cloud based systems are you know they are flexible they are you know they are easily scalable they are reliable and they are cost effective and they provide you know faster you know results also so uh, if you need uh, let's suppose 100 systems tomorrow then you can easily scale in cloud based automation okay so that way you are going to get much faster results of your test cases and you can automate this or you can you know include or integrate this cloud based automation uh, infrastructure in your ci cd pipeline that's where you know if uh, ci cd pipeline triggers your test automation then it is going to pick all the uh, uh, system or all the test cases uh, in and and it is going to execute in cloud based infrastructure so what are different cloud based test automation tools maybe you know uh, this are the uh, source labs browser stack lambda test device form so these all are the cloud based test automation tools so uh, in uh, 2024 or going further also if you are working on automation then please consider learning these tools as well these uh, you know cloud based automation tools also some of them are free if uh, you wanted to learn by yourself then you can go on their website and you can execute uh, your test cases for free for uh, you know uh, if you are learning let me know in the comment box if you are or your company is using any of these uh, cloud based automation tools and if you are uh, wanted to learn also let me know i'll uh, make some videos on this also now uh, number 2 is codeless test automation see nowadays you know automation or testing or software it's on boom right everything every business cannot run without automation without you know without uh, softwares and when software comes testing comes and then uh, when testing comes more and po more people are required right so if uh, there are more and more technical people are required then uh, then also we will have some uh, you know constraints of people so that's where codeless test automation is in picture where you know they help uh, even people with less technical knowledge also to uh, come into the automation and they can help to deliver better quality of the software codeless test automation basically helps uh, you know from the gui or drag and drop any elements are there visual workflows are there through which you can automate the scenarios okay and what are different uh, codeless test automation tools so these are catalon perfecto tosca so if you know these uh, you know these tools let me know in comment box if you don't know then also uh, uh, comment in the comment box that uh, you know you don't know uh, and you wanted to learn okay now number 1 ai artificial intelligence artificial intelligence is everywhere and if you are going to learn and if you wanted to excel in automation or any other career also you have to learn ai test automation 
okay so ai basically we all know that ai helps to you know uh, to implement machine learning and whatever are the analysis part of the test cases like uh, generating the uh, generating executing and analysis of test cases even fixing of the failing test cases so those things are uh, you know easily handled in ai uh, powered test automation and this is going to reduce manual effort and even uh, you know people who are in automation also they need to learn ai for sure and this is the trend in demand so what are different ai powered test automation tools so test im uh, is the one test sigma test rigor mabel functionize ui path apply tools there are so many ai powered uh, test automation tools let me know in the comment box if you know any of these or you wanted to learn this i am going to make uh, videos on all these automation tools also but before that if you haven't subscribed my channel please make sure to subscribe and if you like the uh, content please make sure to hit the like button this will help me to know that you are liking the content and if you are you know your friend is there uh, you wanted to share this uh, information please make sure to share it also that way uh, you know they will also be in the sync with the latest trends in automation testing technologies okay so that was all in this video if uh, you uh, like this video please make sure and don't forget to like button uh, okay and subscribe to the channel amit ripathi signing off